Texas Governor Greg Abbott announced this week that assault victims in his state can use Plan B, a pregnancy preventative known as a next-state contraceptive. We need to help those casualties, but we also need to get those casualties to medical care immediately away, and we need to report it, Abbott said in a pre-recorded interview with KXAS-TV and the Dallas Morning News that will air on Sunday, according to the publication. By seeking medical attention as soon as possible, individuals can obtain the Plan B pill, which will prevent a pregnancy from occurring in any scenario. In terms of policing, outlining it will ensure that the perpetrator is apprehended and charged, according to the morning news, Abbott remarked. CNN has reached out to Abbott's office for comments. Texas's fetus removal trigger regulation, which was passed in 2021 fully anticipating the nullification of Roe v. Swim, went into effect last month, establishing new criminal penalties for fetus removal and providing an exception only for specific health circumstances. The Lone Star State prohibits fetus removal as early as a month and a half into pregnancy, making it one of the strictest in the country, and prohibiting early termination before many women discover they are pregnant. When a fetal heartbeat is detected, fetus removal is prohibited under Texas law. According to the Center for Reproductive Rights, which advocates for expanded access to early abortion, none of the developed nations where fetus removal is legal have imposed a development limit as soon as around a month and a half. Plan B was approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration in 1999. The key ingredient in the pill is a synthetic molecule known as levonorgestrel. This medicine inhibits an egg from being released from the ovary or from being treated by sperm. If there has been